Um, so hi, I'm Andy Jones, I'm the uh, FD at the Port of Milford Haven and just thought I'd quickly chat to you about um, how we do planning at the Port. Uh, financial planning, we've developed, uh, and I think you need to understand your business using Excel. Um, so we've built a lot of Excel models, I'm as sure as many of uh, you watching this have done. And um, we, once I think is what's really important is when do you move away from Excel and start um, developing your own um, you know, more formalized software that gives you the flexibility to be able to um, remodel uh, at, uh, at very short notice and um, you know, have re-forecasts in your business because the business strategy is constantly changing. And um, you know, I think uh, uh, my advice would be you, know, you, you use Excel once you really understand things, you've got it modeled, you really need then you just convert that um, you know, into a software. Um, obviously there are many uh, op options available to do that. Um, we work quite a lot with the Access Group. Um, as well as um, as well as a company called Intelligence, who uh, um, you know work in work in those spaces, and um, um, I think that would be um, you know my advice on uh, on that particular subject. Brilliant. Hi, I'm Adam Brown, the CFO for the Access Group. Um, with regards to business information, the key tools I'm looking at is cash. So we look, we have a, a daily measure of cash, how we're progressing on the cash, yeah. and then in terms of the the sales side of things, I'm looking at leads, meetings, conversions to sales, and then conversion to revenues. That's a key metric of bringing it in. We also look at the services side to see how we're performing on the services side. So a key metric there is what, what is our billing rate, how many days we build out, how much money have we made per day. And to look at all of this, I've got a SaaS-based BI tool, um, which is ours. So it's great because it sits on top of our data and it pulls the data from multiple different databases and presents it in a visual basis that I can see on my iPhone, my iPad, or my computer. Love it, it's great, works all the time. I should be looking at the camera. Um, so, so I really like it a lot. Uh, yeah. and it's very visual and I can change it and adapt it. So I get a financial dashboard, I get a sales dashboard, and I look at those on a regular basis. Brilliant. So I'm James Nicholson Smith, I'm one of the founders of the FD Centre. Uh, we have uh, 100 FDs here in the UK, 25 in Australia, 25 in South Africa, 10 in Canada and we're opening up in the US as well. One of the things that we've learned over our time for about 12 years is that out of all of those FDs, none of them will do forecasting, planning in the same way mm. and that's been a very valuable lesson for us.